Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play Final Fantasy Dawn of Souls or the GBA. I'm Samurai TX, and when we last left off, we did post birthday treasure hunting and we traveled to Melmont, where we currently are, where the city has been um, decayed thanks to Dracula. So, now before we go out on our adventure, we're going to go in the magic shop. What we're going to do is um, buy level 3 cure, which restores a lot of HP. Level 3 cure, we know what it does. If that has the name Kiraga, we're going to give it to Cole, obviously. Life is like um, reviving an um, ally, which is the only thing you can do. And Dialga is a pretty good spell, but we're going to do Hilara, which is Heal 2. So yeah, our white mage is equipped very well. And now we're going to go, because that's the only thing we can really buy, because Grodus is a really strong um, power-up. You see a gravestone? Yes, we do. So now let's go this way to the cave where um, Dracula will be held. I can't guarantee to know where every treasure is in this, um, but if I, um, I'll give you a bonus video just in case. This is one place to grind, which is very well actually, because there's a lot of ogres here and whatnot. But surprisingly, we've not really run into a beast battle. But here's the cavern of Earth. Which way do we go first? I think we're just going to take the left route first. This dungeon has a lot of encounters, and here's our first enemy, the new type of enemy in this, a Minotaur, which dies rather easily. 122 XP and 489 Geo. And Hill Gigas is on you. It's pretty tough, this dungeon, actually, because you're going to run into a lot of random encounters, which is not fun at all. I'm only showing off the new enemies, like the Hill Gigas and whatnot, like you saw, but uh, I will skip some of them except the Earth Elementals in this uh, dungeon. Oh, this is the part where it's going to be a lot of encounters, so yeah, you might see me skip this part a lot, which I'm going to do until I get free space to um, move, so yeah, I'll be back. Level up after beating in two Hill Gigases. Weak stats increase for me. Weak stats increase for Grodus. Barga. Weak stats increase. Coal, the same. But we got a tent. And another enemy encounter. And the same amount of enemies. So, yeah, I'm really going to have to... This corner here is where you get a lot of enemies. So, I'm not going to do this corner. I'm going to um, completely skip this corner until I actually turn around to the right. Alright, I'll be back. Finally, that was about seven random encounters. So, you would just see me cut the video constantly. But yeah, let's use our magic. As you can see, it did a lot of damage, half damage to us, so... Let's use, um, Hilara on all the party. And then again. And we're fully healed, so let's get going. Pretty sure there's treasure this way. Ugh, anacondas? Really? Just as long as you don't turn one of my characters into bloody stone, I don't really care. That is quite a lot of damage. We deserve to die for that. Right, let's go. Oh no. All that time I went around there, it just led me back here. That's lame. You know what? We're going to go to the right first. And we got a crew to go here. Oh, there's treasure up there, so let's go up there first. Two Minotaurs, not too bad. Hopefully we get to attack them first. And we do dead. And dead. Good stuff. 378 jewel. Right, let's go around this way. Oh my word, look at all these ogre chiefs. I'll be back because, well, we've already seen this enemy. Lots of ogre chiefs there, but yeah, they died rather quickly. And I think this is the first time we're going to encounter an earth elemental. Yes, it is. And the Earth Elemental has about nearly 300 HP, but yeah, a few melee attacks should defeat it. Told you. And 384 EXP, very helpful. What a jewel too. And then we get a long jewel here. Nice. We beat five Cobras and we got a level up. We got weak stats increase, of course, for our Grodus. Same thing. Barga, same. And Cole? Cole's the only one that got extra um, HP, that is in single digits. And of course in the process, I got poison, so let's use the antidote. 
And because everybody's on a lot of damage except myself, I'm going to probably use two potions. So yeah, let's use two potions. There we go. Instead of wasting our MP, I should just use the potions. We don't really need that much equipment anyway, because we bought some before we went ahead, and this is going to be a skip. There we go, let's keep going now. Well, we've been, we've been ambushed by Minotaurs. Oh, 30 damage. 15. Alright, that's not too bad. Punish him. Ow. Nice. Ow, can you stop picking on me, please? I know I'm the strongest guy in the team, but stop doing that. 234. Let's go down here now. I think that's the only real treasure here. I might have missed some, but I'm going to skip this because Anacon. Actually, not. Let's beat him up, shall we? Let's bully him. Critical hit. Oh, God. That was quite a bit of damage, you silly little Anaconda. Ah, you missed. Don't kill me. I'm the last one. Oh, I am going to help. And Anaconda dies. In peace. More anacondas. No, please don't kill oh, oh, oh. Excellent. Is there a treasure down there? I think there is. And boy, am I not I'm skipping this. I'll be back. Flee the way from the evil spiders. But then we get mummies. We haven't seen these in some time, but they do drop some good gills, so let's just eliminate them. Critical hit. Another critical hit. We should get another um, first hit advantage. Never mind. But they missed twice. That was their best advantage. And they failed. 375 and that's one. Wow, they dropped 300 gil each. And we're going to face Minotaurs. We've got preemptive strike on them. Even better. Goodbye. Time. Goodbye. <laughs> Oh god, this Oh, there's an Earth Elemental. I think we gotta fight two of them now. And it's dead. Good stuff. 880 Jill and another Elemental. Maybe it's because we opened this. Maybe it's because we're in front of the second chest. But that is okay, because. Ow. We did quite a bit of damage, sir. But Cold killed it of all people. And this is a potion. Hmm. I think um, I think I'm gonna get more potions out actually. So using our magic. Let's just um just cure it in magic. There we go. Yeah, I don't really see the point in me using magic unless we're really on dangerous territory. <laughs> no, I'm not fighting all these cobras. So, Alright, let's go. Right off. Oh. I avoid cobras to fight anacondas. Brilliant! Woohoo, just what we needed. More anacondas! Ow, that wasn't nice. 36 damage, Cole. Um, that's kind of better than normal. But still not the required damage to kill things, unless if it's a wolf. There we go. Right. Is it this way I'm supposed to be going? Right, random encounters central. Ah, more treasures. 775 Jill and an antidote. Thanks. I do need those actually, so I'm not really complaining per se. Gargoyles! You know what? Let's fight them while we're here. Two damage. Used to do more damage than that, but because we've grown stronger, you guys have gone more and more pathetic. As the journey's gone on, even Cole's defense is pretty good. Can you stop picking on Cole and Barga? Like, I'd appreciate it if you don't. Ow. Alright, keep attacking. Good job. Didn't even break a sweat. Nice work. Right, we're going to go to the second floor because I think that's all the treasures we got for the first floor. I'm not going to double check because this is random encounter central. I really should be skipping this fight, but I'm not going to bother. Because, um, well, I haven't encountered these as much as Cobras and Anacondas. Ow. Only one damage. Pathetic. Die. The second floor should be right here. Okay. 
Alright, let's go to the second Let's not go to the second floor because stupid cobras are in the way. The cobras will die. They're not really that strong to be honest. I think the anacondas are much stronger. Haha, <laughs> you missed. There is only one cobra remaining. Oh, kill me! Oh. Alright, stop interfering with my adventure. Alright, is there any treasure down here? I don't think there is. That would be great. Ambushed by Ogre Chiefs. Cool. They're gonna drop us 1,200 jewels, so... I'm going to continue. I'm gonna actually not skip this fight. Normally I would skip the same fights, but um, here I'm not going to. Goodbye. You are dead. Right, only one HP damage. Man, you guys are weak. You really underestimate my ability. You're weak. Just stealing Itachi's quad, because why not? A Minotaur. You're weak. It's gone to the point where this dungeon is actually pretty useless, you know, in terms of the enemies that do damage to us. <coughs> Wasn't fighting the Cobras. No point really, no point really. Um, is there anything down here? I think there is. I think there is actually. Let's fight the Minotaur though. And delete it from existence. And more fighting. Yeah, Ogre's an Ogre Chief. <laughs> You're dead. Ow. Good hammering. And he is dead. Excellent stuff. We gained a level. So yeah, it was worth fight. Not worth the stats increase boost though for me. Not for Grodus, except the MP. What about Bonga? Nope, not even him. What about Cole? Nope. Except the MP increase. And we get welcomed by Earth Elemental as soon as we enter through the door, so not a surprise. And that is an amazing bit of damage. My goodness. Wow, 266. Alright, so that's a level shield. Useless. 575 Jill and 5000 Jill. I'll take that of a bloody uh, level shield. Right, more Earth Elementals. And a pain, a pain elemental. I was thinking of Yugi over there. But yeah, the elemental's dead. Another Minotaur. And that Minotaur is gone. Very easy. It's the swords that are making this easy with the early uh, Mystic Key doors. But um, in the previous game, if you. Um, in the um, NES version, if you had um, silver. Um, silver swords and silver equipment in the early stages, you're pretty good. Because I think the silver was easily the best parts of the game, actually, in the NES version. Um, I have to show you if I play it in the future, but um, I played the GBA version because it's more modern. That's the reason why I picked this one, but. Um, never say never to play in Final Fantasy again on the NES. Even though it's much more harder, if I'm honest with you. Preemptive strikes on Ogre Chiefs. You know what, I'm going to keep the best of this battle in. Don't know why I'm not going to. Um, well, there we go. Cole should kill this guy. And we do. Preemptive strikes for the win. Let's open this door and grab the treasures. 330 Jill. Tent. And a Corral Sword. Which is good against um, aquatic monsters, so we don't need it because we're on 31 attack and I don't think it does much for us, it only just does 31. Maybe we should equip it. What about Grodus? We'll give Grodus the Worm Killer. And Barga don't need anything, so Barga and Grodus says 27 and I still am on 21. We're going to keep the Weird Buster because it's still useful. But let's keep going. Now let's put that uh, um, weird boss. Let's put that um, Coral Sword to the test. Even though these, they had a preemptive strike and they've only hit me once, so their accuracy is not really that high from the sounds of things. And look at that! Did you see the sp spikes on it? And that's what makes that weapon even cooler. The fact that it has spikes on it and whatnot. Right. There was four of you. Now there's only one. And unfortunately for you, I'm afraid I've got some bad news. You're dead. Right, let's use potions again. Let me see. Um, 
You know, we'll use one Kira. Um, not Kira, but um, Kiraga, sorry. No, not Kiraga, um, Hilera. There we go. And then we're going to Potion Gronus. Yeah, might as well use Potions and Gronus instead of using them. Cure. 50 HP, that should be good enough to pull him at full health. And it is. Me, I'm doing okay, so I don't really need it. Now let's go this way. Uh, let's just go to the third floor, shall we? As I was saying, let's go to the third floor. I think it's. I don't think it's this way. Silly gargoyles, speaking this standard chart. Eight gargoyles. My God, eight. That's hilarious. Eight gargoyles. They really are stacking up, aren't they, these gargoyles? Because they know they stand no chance if they come as one. Alright, so I think we need to go... Oh, Minotaurs. But I think we need to go down now. But the Minotaurs are then after a critical hit. But I think we need to go down here. Is it down here? No, it's not. I think we need to go up and go around this way. Bloody gargoyles, stop numbering on me, man. Right, let's go this way. Uh, is it this way? I think it is, actually. Right, let's keep going. Go down. No, is it down this way? Ogre Chiefs. Yeah, yeah, we're going to fight these, but not on screen. I don't think it's down here. Well, let's see. Now we've already been down there. Great, we got poison. Well, two of my ally, two of my people got poison. Barga and me. Seems I'm always getting poison. Barga on the other hand, that's his first time. But me, not so much. Heal, 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 heal. Barga is doing okay. Right, so we need to go up. As I was saying, we need to go up and go this way. Silly gargoyles thinking they stand a chance. Silly cobras thinking they stand a chance. Poor gargoyles going down. Right, let's go here. Up this... Oh, Peace Cold Demons. Wow, this is the first time we've seen you in a very long time, actually, Peace Cold Demons. Attack. Attack his life points directly. And he is dead. All of them are. 900 Jill. We gained a level. Thanks, Peace Cold Demons. And we got a strong stats increase for the first time in this video. What about Gronus? He's got a stats increase. Great. Do you know who needs it? Manga. Everyone's on 300 plus. Manga's not even reached 300 yet. But that's what he needs. He's on 292 health. Great. And Cole got. That's unfair. Cole's always getting the most. Cold, stop hogging the um, stats increases. Right, let's go in here. And we're going to run into it. Oh! Whites and gas. Okay. Right, let's fight these guys when they let us have a go. Ah, you missed. Ow. Okay, okay. Ah, oh, paralysis. You are joking me, right? You are dead. Alright, keep abusing me. That's fine, you can keep abusing me. I'm okay! I like getting abused. I like getting abused. Okay? I love it. Keep abusing me. Come on, give me more. I said give me more, not Bonga. Jeez. Alright. Oh, good damage, Cole. Barga's going to need some healing after this. And he's going to guarantee to get some healing now. Man, I took a beat in there. Not as much as Barga since he's in danger. So, Cole, use your magic to heal Barga. So, yeah, let's give Barga that. There we go. Oh, that was a lot. Jeez. Right, now we're going to use Cure on Gronus. Might as well. Cure him again. Cure on me. And curing yourself. Good stuff. Now let's grab this. A sleeping bag. 
Hmm. Interesting. Wraiths. Jesus, we've not seen wraiths in a while, have we? But we're going to kill them. We've really got to pick up the pace in order to be um, Dracula. But let's keep going. Oh, that was critical hit. Right. Probably this is our turn to attack. It's not. And we got paralyzed. But a critical hit has prevented us from staying paralyzed. We've got a cross here. Eh. Don't really need it. Right, is there anything this way? Mummies! Apart from mummies. Is there anything this way apart from mummies? Ah, you missed. You die for it. 600 Jill. Oh, we just came from this way. I'm so stupid. Why am I going this way? Okay, so we moved away from the door where we were. And we've run into more Peace Code demons. So skip. Alright, so we defeat the Peace Code. You know, let's beat this ogre sheep on screen. It's only one of them. Maybe we beat the Peace Code demons. Now we can go up. That was easy. 300 Jill. Thank you. Ah. Let's go. That treasure room is empty, so ignore it. Eh, they were just peace code demons. Those were just wolves. Silly wolves. Cockatrices. I don't think we faced these yet. So yeah, these are um, typical Final Fantasy enemies. Oh yeah, you got to be careful, because if you get attacked by them too many times, or if they get a critical, they can actually turn you into stone. So yeah, you got to be careful. Don't make these cockatrices turn you into stone, unless you have gold needle, or um, a spell that kills you from that status. But we got um, a gold needle, so yeah, we're going to use it so that we don't actually get stoned to death. Ah, you missed. Nice try, loser. 279 XP, 1,200 Jill. Gold need see? I was just talking about that. And we're gonna go in here. Let's go in here, because I think this there's no treasure in here. Okay. Maybe I was I was trolling myself. Right, let's go in here. And we're gonna run into an elemental. Yeah, we'll fight it, why not? Alright, so yeah, we have had a massive stats increase over the um, past few videos. The um, past video actually. I said in this oh jeez, I did not open the treasure. You silly sausage samurai, you did not open the treasure, you silly silly boy. Please kill this guy. Well done, Cole. And we got 1200 jewel, it was worth it, okay? Going back for the jewel was very well worth it. Now we're going here. Vampire. All the things in this world are destined to end in death. The seal cannot be broken, and so the earth shall rot. <laughs> you are quite an intimidating guy. Intimidating guy. You cannot alter destiny. <laughs> Mere mortals cannot kill the undying. We shall see. Alright, so he might look intimidating, but he's actually got lower than 300 health, so we're strolling off the beating, so we could we could use haste and stuff to try and um, beat him, but I don't think we're going to need it. Um, Cole should have some magic here. We're going to use Diara on him. Uh-oh. Ah, he's paralyzed me. What a bugger. Why am I always the unlucky one? Anyway, we're going to use Diara spell. 106 stat. Wow. And we're going to use another Diara spell. That's quite a bit of damage, but he's not really that strong like I told you. And we've earned 300 EXP, 2000 Jill. Nice. He is beaten. Now we're going to see what's in here. Braves. Now you know, I'm going to skip this fight and then I'll be back. Alright, so we got the raves out of so let's see what's in this treasure. We're nodding, so it's a key treasure. You obtained the Star Ruby. Now, if I remember correctly, the hint that was given to us in the previous video was that um, 
uh, a monster likes to eat jewelry, so we're going to need to give that to the monster. So let's check where we need to go first before. Okay, as I was saying, there is a pathway. This is it. So let's read it. A stone slab set on the floor. An evil force seems to em emanate from within. So we need to um, get rid of this stone. So we need to go back to find that monster. So that's what we're going to do in the next video because it's been 25 minutes. So we're going to save here, obviously, because we're um, a lot of levels. We have level up four times in this video. But when we come back, folks, we're going to play more. Final Fantasy, The Dawn of Souls. Oh my goodness, 68,000 Jill. We can actually afford that um, treasure now, that um, armor. But anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your day. Goodbye.